Hey guys, welcome and welcome back to my channel. My name is Hawa Bunga. If you're not subscribed to my channel, what are you waiting for? Go ahead and hit that subscribe button below and become a ninja. In today's video, I'm going to be doing a tour of my beauty skincare fridge. Remember in my video that you could check right here where I had a wish list of what I want for Christmas. And on my wish list, there was a beauty skincare fridge. I received that for Christmas from Santa Claus. So I'm very happy about that. I just want to give y'all a tour of what's in my beauty fridge because I think it's a fun video. I never did it before. So if you want to see a what's in my beauty skincare fridge, then just keep on watching. For Christmas, if you do remember, I asked for a beauty skincare fridge and Santa brought me a beauty skincare fridge yay it's the Astro A1 brand I got the four liter refrigerator it's a mini fridge so you actually can use it for anything like if you travel and you can plug it up in your car it comes with a port to plug it up in your car and also it stays warm or hot for a long time after it's been unplugged so that's what I really love about it um, just to show you the box that it came in it looks like this like this all the features of the fridge on here talks about how it's um, efficient cooling low noise rapid warming environmental friendly um, and energy saving perfect for portability so it's a port portable fridge I know sometimes um even people that take like medicine like insulin things like that will get a portable fridge so when they're like traveling or in a hotel anything like that um, sometimes hotels don't have refrigerators, so you can bring your own refrigerator. So let's get into it. So oh, I have this in my bathroom, but the light in my bathroom sucks, so I brought it out here to like the, my bedroom area. And so, can you all see it? It's this extra one. It has like a little door handle right here, and on the top it has a handle, so you could carry it around. You do like this open right here on the door. It gives you like a notice of like what to do um, when you first get it, how to use it, all of that jazz. Um, so let's just get into the fridge. My Vagine Labs Glow Serum. I love this stuff. I use it in the daytime or at night. This is one of my favorites because when I tell you if you want to glow baby use this and your skin will be glowing with and without makeup so it's one of my faves the next serum that i have in my fridge is rose oil blend from pixie uh i love this feels amazing it smells amazing it works wonders for my skin if you have oily or dry skin you can use this serum the next thing i have in my fridge i am a beijing serum girl so a lot of my serums are by this brand so and let me tell you like with serums being in this fridge like after you know it's been in here for a while and it's cool when you do your skincare routine it feels so amazing and soothing to the skin like i love it oh so i have this overnight repair it has retinol and blue tnc it's a facial oil it's a serum i like to use it at night i kind of use it as a mask so after i done my whole skincare routine this is the last thing i put on my face and i mix it with a moisturizer so this is a must have more Beijing products. Oh, the next one I have is this facial serum. It's the firming one. This, um, I would say if you're starting to get wrinkles on your face, on your forehead, under your eye, like bags under your eyes, definitely use this. It will help tighten your skin and firm it. And it's good for the long haul. So even if you don't have wrinkles, even if you don't have saggy skin as of yet, I would recommend using some type of firming serum serum this is one of my faves brands wise um because you're basically going to be ahead of the game before you even get them honey we're going to switch it up a little bit this toner from old henderson it came with um actually a set i love to keep my serums and my toners cold so this is one of my faves that i put in my fridge because it has like a minty refreshing feel to it and when it's cold it's even better it's like oh my god like oh um this is a balanced oil control toner so it's particularly good for oily skin so i wouldn't recommend this for dry skin and i don't use this um in the winter months as much because it really um soaks up the oil 
Next thing I have, I'm going to show you on our skincare tour is my glow. It's a glow recipe watermelon glow sleeping mask. So it's a mask that you put on right before bed. So when you do your nighttime skincare routine, you can um, put this mask on as the last step. And when I tell you, you wake up, like it smells so good. It's a watermelon and it's kind of, it has like a jelly substance or whatever like really jelly and is a really like silky smooth I don't know if you can see that you see how that looks that's how your skin your face looks when you wake up in the morning I lied to you not it looks super glowy it looks refreshing it doesn't even look like you like just woke up if you woke up you could literally be like I woke up like this because this will make you feel like that also a sleeping mask from the glow recipe which is the brand um, this one is the avocado melt retinol sleeping mask literally like avocado like if you was to smush up an avocado and put it on your face this is basically what that is and I use this mask when my face is feeling like really like dry and I can see every pore on my face that's this is what I use is really good for just making your skin look flawless and that's that the serum that I have in my fridge is the hydrate serum for from Beijing lab when I tell you this is amazing for any skin combination yes even if you have oily skin you're supposed to hydrate your skin because your skin will try to overcompensate if you dry your skin out so if you have oily skin and you don't put any moisturizer no serum nothing on your face um, your skin is going to feel dry and think that it's dry and try to produce oils it really just helps hydrate your skin just like if you you will hydrate your body by drinking water um, when you're thirsty this does that to your skin this is a, a moisturizer balm by Garnier 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 I always struggle with saying that. I don't know why um, it has the antioxidant super moisturizer so this is really this is another like hydrating balm I mainly I kind of use this as an overnight mask sometimes because it has the same consistency as the um my real overnight mask like that jelly and then when you wake up your skin is like kind of glowy like I showed you before um, I love using this at nighttime because it it is kind of um kind of oily I like using it when my skin is a feeling um dry or if I feel like I'm having a breakout come through or anything like that I like to use this in my skincare routine this is a balm moisturizer and face primer by Bobbi Brown it is pretty expensive but if you can you could probably catch this a product at like um, Marshall's or Ross or TJ Maxx very good product product a very thick moisturizer is awesome for a base before you put on your makeup especially if you're using mattifying primer and a mattifying foundation this is a good thick moisturizer to start your face off with this is going to be kind of weird to y'all, but this is my Y Selmon Paris. It's actually a body lotion and it's a, oh, can you see? So it's a fragrance body lotion. However, like I use this when I am, when I don't want to wear a perfume, but I do want a scented lotion. I just want to smell good. Like if I'm going um, to an event or even if I'm going to work, I like to put this on my neck, <laughs> like my neck area. And it feels good when it's cold. So that's why I put it in my fridge because I feel like in the morning time, just having cool products on your face and your skin kind of wakes up your skin in the morning. So that's why I have this in my fridge and I like the aesthetic of it. It's pretty. So <laughs> wanted to show you that if you're anything like me and when you break out your breakouts leave a mark whenever I break out whenever I get a pimple anything on my face it always leaves a dark mark um these this is one of my favorite products to use to kind of get rid of those dark marks I put it on at night and it eventually fades the dark spots on my face um I use this and I use the 8 Ambi fading cream but that one is too big to fit in my fridge so I put this in there um, I feel like it really locks the product into your skin, especially when getting rid of those dark marks. So this is a great product to keep in your beauty fridge and that's, you know, why I keep it on. Keep it in mind. It's the e.l.f. eye cream. I haven't showed you all eye cream yet. This is my only eye cream that I have in my fridge. 
I really, 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 really like e.l.f. products, um, makeup and makeup and skin crumb products. It really eliminates the appearance of dark circles around your eyes. I really love it. This product is so inexpensive and you would think that it wouldn't work because it's inexpensive, but no, baby. No, this thing works wonders. When I have dark circles on my eyes, I use this and it actually works. I can see the difference within days, baby. So yeah, this is one of my go-tos. Um, I actually just opened this one because I had another one that I completely finished. I used it all out. So if you all, if anyone's ever asking me like, how come you don't have dark circles under your eyes? How come you don't have bags? This is um, one of the reasons why. Yeah, mask. So I use, I keep all of my smaller masks in here. I have a lot more masks, but as I go through them, I refill it. So as I use these masks, I put more masks in in there. So I have these hydrating um, under eye pads. Um, I use this whenever I give myself, like I do random facials. I probably do a facial like once a week, um, just to like pamper myself and pamper my face. So this is one of the masks um, that I use. I have a few like under eye masks. This is this one that I use. Um, they feel so good when it's cold and you put it under your eye. Like <laughs> feels like heaven. Um, another one that I use is lip patch one. I actually haven't used this yet, but I can't wait to use it. Um, I've heard nothing but good things about this and good reviews on these patches, so I'm excited. Another mask that I have in here is the Deep Cleaning Deep Clean Purify and Pill Off Mask by Neutrogena. I have tons and tons and tons of Neutrogena face masks because they are my favorite. Um, so I always use them and replace them in the fridge because cold mask on your face feel awesome your skin absorbs it more and it locks the product into your skin so even after you remove the mask it's still working in your skin and the product is still working and working for you so i definitely recommend having your mask having your mask cold so guys that's a pretty much it for the tour of my skincare fridge um just the fyi this fridge can also be warm so if you wanted to switch it up sometimes like once i go through all of these products i probably switch it to warm and then start putting my products that needs to be warm in there and the products that needs to be warm are cleansers and exfoliators and i think some masks like certain masks could be warm so if you have a beauty fridge or a skincare fridge let me know in the comments of what you put in your fridge let me know if you want to see my beauty fridge tour with my warm products because baby i have a ton of skincare products and i'll be excited to show you all what else Thank you all for watching. I hope you all really enjoyed that video. Again, if you're not subscribed to my channel and you want to see more content like this and all of my beauty, fashion, and lifestyle content, hit that subscribe button below and join the ninja gang. Like, who don't want to be a ninja? Baby, I know you want to be a ninja. Like, I'll catch you in my next video. Bye!